So, my husband, my husband is filming me right now. I got my cup of, cup of coffee. Everybody has to have a cup of coffee. I got my sparkly slippers on. I got my sparkly pajama and loungewear, Lydia style. I was like, I gotta find something that it doesn't make me look like a schlub. <laughs> okay, so this is the um, this is my <clears throat> I have tagged myself with this youtuber named Smoky Glow and she's adorable I like her she seems really cool and funny and I love funny I'm a big funny person person and she has put out a list of questions for smaller creators to answer it says small creator tag Smoky Glow all right so these are the questions so how many years have you been on YouTube I don't know like since 2010 2009? I think uh, when you really got into it, kind of the last year we was in Chesapeake. So that was like 2011. Well, I don't know. I have to go. Let me check. I'm going to check. I'm going to put see what my first video, when did I first post my video? So six years ago, 2012. 2012. Mm -hmm. For some reason, I think I've been on longer. But anyway, I think, well, actually, have you been on YouTube? 2012. But... I know I've been watching YouTube a lot longer, so that's what it is. Hi, Maggie. Maggie, you gonna come help me answer some questions? You gonna help me answer some questions? You can come here. Okay. What was your first video about? My first video about was um, starting my um, my kind of brand, as you will, uh, called Tired Lady, and it was Tired Lady's Guide to Life, and it was about just about everything that I'm doing today about coping with chronic illness, um, ideas about how to take care of yourself and still look fabulous, even on a budget. And so yeah, that's what that was about. My dream collab. Now my husband knows what the dream collab is. It's her friend in her head. Yes, friend in my head, Lydia Elise Millen. That would be, oh! That would be such a dream collab. Oh my gosh. I just love her. I think she's amazing. She's like, she's like a, she's like a modern day Audrey Hepburn. So anyway, she's, yeah, Lydia Lee Milan. She's a, she's a YouTuber, huge YouTuber. And she lives in, uh, in England. Hi, what? Come here. Okay, hold on. We gotta, we gotta get you set up here. Do you want to come sit with me? There we go. There's the two girls. There we are. There's my girl. Anyway, so I love her. So she does, she just does, I, the other person, well, anyway, so she, she does like stuff that I like, you know, fashion, but she also shares about her life and she's kind of quirky, kind of funny. So I, I love her for that. All right. Oh, yes. she takes fancy purses to the gym. And she takes fancy purses to the gym. I am such an overdresser. My husband will tell you, my husband will look like, you know, like he just crawled out of bed. I... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, something like that. Okay. What is your end? Oh, let's see. What would it mean for you to you to make it on YouTube? What would it mean to make it on YouTube? If I got to collab with Lydia Elise Milan. <laughs> no, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I had. I'm not sure how would I would how, how I would answer that. I know that my dream is beyond YouTube that I want to start a brand called Tired Lady. That's why I call my channel that. And I want to help women. I just want to help women. I want to help them take better care of themselves. I want them to enjoy life. I don't want them to feel guilty all the time. I want them to take time for themselves. And yeah. All right. So yeah, that would be the end goal. It says, what is your end goal on YouTube? My end goal is that is I want to have like seriously like I want to have my own robes slippers like everything that has to do with comfort and taking care of yourself and also on a budget like I find it really annoying to for so many people who are sick who cannot get access to good um, ways to cope because it costs money. A couple people that send back messages saying that I really helped them. My view is one million dollars. Yeah, well, see, that's not my thing. Maggie, <laughs> if you have to pee, you're going to have to hold it, okay? She doesn't. Do you want to come here? I just took her out. Come here. 
and don't bother me. I'm trying to do my video. Okay. What is the hardest part about YouTube? Well, I think the hardest part about YouTube isn't so much for me, but it's a way, it's, you know, really, I, I think going back to the end goal of YouTube, I don't want to stay on YouTube forever because I do think that the way they, their practices are really terrible. I mean, people, really horrible people somehow get a chance to stay on YouTube. <coughs> Call Logan Paul. Um, <laughs> and, you know, because they make, he makes them bajillions of dollars. Oh, wait a minute. YouTube just shut you down. I just yeah. got a message. Sorry. So, <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of problems with YouTube. So I would say more like just the way that they don't handle serious situations properly. Bullying. They don't, well, they, they, they allow bullying to happen. They allow so many things to happen. Weird stuff. Uh, best part of YouTube, best part is definitely when I get comments. Like there's this one gal, her name is Bridget Donovan. And she, you know, she also has issues with her health and she comments. And, you know, when I get a couple of comments like that and, well, you know, that things that they, you know, what I'm doing really helps them or I really like that idea. Like that, I love that part. What is the funniest comment you've ever gotten? Somebody said that I had a weird accent. I don't know. I was just like, huh? I mean, I don't think I have a weird... I mean, now, when I came right out of New York, I probably had an accent. And also, when I was living in South Dakota in the Midwest as a kid, I definitely had an accent. But... I don't hear it now. I don't know what that means. What is the meanest comment you've ever gotten? Okay. I've had a couple of them, but let me just relate it to my channel. Not so much when I've been on other uh, situations. This one guy... I should find the I should find the comment. He was like, "Cause okay, you know I have a chronic illness, but I love fashion. And on a whim, I decided I was gonna Maggie, please. This is perfect. Please let me answer this question. Let me do this. On a whim, I decided to film a video about my Poshmark closet. Fine, this is a double no, take. No, please. You... Okay. Seriously, she's Maggie. kicking me out. out. She got to kick her out. I get it. No, no, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. It's all our YouTube fans. She. Yeah. Oh, go. I'm sorry, but you're. She's like breathing and she's like wants <laughs> something. You know how she does that hovering. Yeah. And I don't know what she wants. And right now I'm trying to do a video. Usually she's okay. Usually she doesn't bug me, but this time she was bugging me. So anyway, back all to right. the mean comment. Okay. So the meanest comment. So so backstory is that yeah I was I was making this video, and I wanted I had this idea of stuff that I'm selling in my Poshmark closet, who would that look really great with and give them some ideas for outfits. Now, I was in my pajamas. Uh, I was not looking uh, too fashionable, I guess. And so somebody said, oh, it's such a shame that you're dressed in, in the sad pajamas and something, just a mean comment like that, you know? Like, oh, it's, it's like your dated, vin your da not even vintage, your dated pajamas and, and you know, blah, 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 whatever. And and I was just like, oh. I me mean, I tried to find the video, the, the comment. I don't think I deleted it. I don't know where it is. I can't find it. Anyway, <laughs> I am currently having a hot flash right now. I'm going through menopause and I'm like sweating. It's so annoying. Menopause is no fun. Yeah, it is. He's got you. Yeah, I, right oh, here. Oh, you're sweating right yeah. there. Need a towel? No, it's not that bad. Okay. Anyway, that's what happens when you get old. You don't look old. Thank you, but I look good. Look good. All right, what other subject matter could you create a YouTube channel about? What other subject matter? Uh, another subject matter would be comedy. Like, I would love to just do, like, the kind of stuff that, like, Vine stuff, like, funny stuff. Like, the musicali, musicali, whatever it is, where you, like, lip sync songs and stuff like that. Like, I could totally do that. That would be so fun. Okay. <laughs> what video are you embarrassed by? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't think I have anything so far that I've been embarrassed about. No, you can always edit it in any way. So, yeah. yeah. I don't know. I have to like think. Okay. Anyway, my husband, he's annoying. Uh, no, he's not. Okay. So what video are you most proud of? Is one that I just recently made. I dressed to Marlene Estelle and I said, Hey, you know, I, sh I shared some tips that I have 
and I was talking about how, uh, and, and I really want her to like discover me and take a look at me because there's not a lot of women out there. I mean, there's not a lot of creators out there that are up there with some of the ones that we have today who are over the age of 35. Are, what are you, you're, stop. Well, I just noticed something and it kind of offends me. Not offends me, but I've never seen you had this. What's it say? The man who said it can't be done should not interrupt the woman doing it. When did you get that plaque? I've had that for a while. I've never seen that before. I showed it to you. Anyway, that's caught my eye. Mm, okay, well, anyway, pay attention. Okay. And what is your first YouTube memory? What is my... Oh, well, easily, easily the panda sneeze. I mean, that's one of the first ones. The panda that's sneeze. classic. The dramatic gopher. Dun, dun, dun. dun. Uh, the other one was the, um, Cat jumping. Huh? The cat jumping out the window. And he oh, slipped yeah. and fell. <laughs> <laughs> he went about two inches. That was so funny. <laughs> yeah. So, anyway, thank you so much for, um, I hope, I, I'm going to put this all together so it's a little bit more coherent. But that was my video. I hope anybody else watching this will come and hang out with me. I, I really hope that you will check out my content. Um, I do um, health related. I do comedy, like funny stuff. I do life, uh, arts and crafts, um, uh, fashion, home decor, um, just living life. I also talk about my pets. I talk about my marriage, all kinds of good stuff. So I hope you'll Come and join me. Now, I am not one of those. I am notoriously unreliable. So, I can't be the kind of person that says, I upload such and such. I, if I can upload every day, I will upload every day. If I can't do it every day, then I can't do it every day. But, but it, I, I love doing this. So, it's something I always, like, you know, I definitely have a passion for and will continue to do. So, anyway, um, so, I know I'm going to regret it. <laughs> trying to get in. Door, trying to get in. All right. Anyway, so that's the video. 